Well, hello all YouTubers out there. I'm gonna share with you what I'm doing today before we get started. We're gonna do a paracord nest. See how I made this with no knots whatsoever all the way around. Looks like a little nest that your egg or your your dinosaur egg or crystal or anything you want sits in on top of a walking stick. Stay with me. I'm going to show you how I did it. Okay, I'm now getting ready to put the paracord on the dinosaur egg to hook it to the end of the stick, make it look good. And what you want to do is just take your double arms length like that across like I'm doing and cut that off and you've got, got your paracord set up and ready to go. Now I want to take the paracord and divide it in the middle, find the middle like that, put the ends together. Now there's your middle. Bring it around and just tie it in a, like you're tying a shoe, like you're starting to tie a shoe, and just stop before you put it in a bowl. Uh, that's what I put on right there. Now, that's right up, let it go in that crack right there. Now, hang on, because we're not going to do it like, uh, like you think. I'm going to go around the bottom. Hold that, hold that tight right there. I'm going around the bottom, and I'm going to do the same thing. Pull that through, but I'm going to pull it tight now, and let it go right on like we're going to just act like we're going to go right on down the stick with it like that. But instead of going that direction, bring this loop back on the top toward the toward the egg. Get it tight. And now tie your knot back on this side, on the egg side, just like that. If you've got it tight so far, it won't slip down like it just did get that tight and then we want to just tie it down on that side of the egg go around now we're going to go around tie another one on the bottom on the egg side got to keep that knot from coming loose on you however you've got to do it. And we're going to tie it up toward the egg again. Now this time, I'm going to tie it on the top, but I'm going to go down on the stick and tie the knot and let it go toward the stick. Then I go around. Now it's starting to get tight and stay there. Now I want to go around and go let it loop up and tighten. I'll turn this over so you can see it. I think right there. Now, that's something, there it is. Now I'm gonna bring that loop up and I want it to tight, yeah, like that. And I want it to slip down on the normally if you're going down the stick you'd tighten it right here and let it go down but you want to tighten it up toward the ball side of things right there now when we turn it over back to the top i want to tie it to where it goes down on the bottom now the knot's going to be tied make sure that's tied again now we're going to go down and let it creep up on the stick and now we'll go around 
again. And see this time it's going to lap instead of tying the knot down toward the stick we're letting it lap up back up on the ball again and then we go around and we have to tie that on the ball again this time we want it to creep up down on the ball like that Next time, we will turn it over, let it go down on the stick. It's overlapped. You see it went, it looped all the way from here down to the stick now. I don't know. Okay. Now, if you have enough, we go around again, but I don't think we are. We want to end up on the stick. So what I'm going to do is make another loop. Now, right here, and let it come down opposite side. And we want it to go down the stick a little. I'm going to stop it right there. I can pull it tight and I get my super glue again and uh, get it ready make sure it's that little loop is tight there and then all I'm going to do is put me a spot of glue right on that so as to keep that from Keep that from slipping down. Now, once we get our super glue on there, let it let it dry just a little bit. Take your handy little pliers here. If you cut the angle where it angles down to a point to where it won't show. You can actually tuck it under there where it don't show the the cut mark. There it is. This one the same way. We get around here and cut where the taper is below that. Now I'm going to stick that right down there. And I can take a small screwdriver and I can stick that under that just a little bit to where that don't show. Get it to where it don't show. Super glue again. And I put a drop of super glue where I have that tucked in. Now that don't show. And uh, I'm going to stick this one the same way. I will, uh, let me turn that camera around here. I will put that on a soft surface there, and I want to stick this end under there to where it don't show either. So when it looks like it's going back where it came from, put a little super glue on it, or put a little CA glue. Right there. And with the little glue on it, it will stay where you put it. And you can get it under there to where your 
end of your ties. Now, that's exactly what we want. And when you get done, if you look at that, you can barely see where it was, where it was tied, no knots, very smooth around there. And uh, there you have it for today's dinosaur egg attachment. And uh, if you like it, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, I'm still needing subscribers. And one more thing, let's see, let's get in position here. I want to tell you something. I'll see you in the next video.